Well, hello. Listen up. Listen up. Listen up. I sound like I'm on Facebook. <laughs> I'll just listen up stuff. But listen, I am excited about tonight. 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 Tonight is a, tonight's service is a precursor to the big women's weekend that's taking place here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. Now, my wife is going to be ministering the Word of God this Sunday here at the church, and she's on with the Word. I just spoke to our guest, Prophetess Barbara Calloway, on her way to the airport to catch her flight to come here, and uh, she's going to be ministering the Word of the Lord uh, tomorrow night here in a women's only service and also Saturday during the day at 10.30 a.m. There is going to be an awesome service. I think it's at 10 a.m. on, on Saturday, uh, a luncheon and, and, uh, and then the Sunday service. And God has already spoken to me concerning the women's weekend and has, de and has declared that he is going to pour out a blessing. And this blessing is a powerful blessing that you don't want to miss. But tonight, uh, on last week, before I get to tonight, on last week, the Lord spoke to me and, and told me to preach the Sermon on the Mount. So last Thursday night's message, we, we began talking about that powerful, powerful message that our Lord delivered. It starts in Matthew's Gospel, chapter 5, and it, it, it concludes in Matthew's Gospel, chapter 7. A powerful sermon. But listen, the Lord spoke to me for uh, tonight and said, I want you to, we're going to do, we're going to resume the Sermon on the Mount the next time. But God has given me a message that is a precursor to the women's weekend. And I want to invite everyone. You don't want to miss this message. Now, my brothers, of course, every word that we preach uh, is for us. The Bible is patriarchal, and God always speaks to the men, but also the God speaks to the women. Amen. Uh, the, he made us all, and there's a word for us. But this word tonight, this word tonight is going to be a tremendous blessing. I want the women of the church, I want the men of the church to come out and hear this word. I actually, I came up yesterday. The Lord put it on my heart. I came up yesterday and God gave me this word and being Wednesday and, and preached in, 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 in Rock Hill, uh, Fort Mills, South Carolina, Fort Mills, uh, Tuesday night, and God the Holy Ghost said, said drive home. I, was, I had a room. I could have stayed overnight. The Spirit of the Lord says, no, go back to Raleigh. And I got up Wednesday. Thank God he blessed me and, and came in, and the Lord met me and gave me uh, the message for tonight. Now, I'm going on a little longer than I normally do because this is a very, very, very important word. I want you to come out, and I want you to come on time, and we're going to study the word of the Lord together. I'm going to talk about resourceful women uh, in the press, resourceful kingdom women. And you are a resourceful kingdom woman. And if you're not, God's going to make you one. And the Lord is going to reward, listen to this, listen to this, your resourcefulness. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. So I'll meet you here tonight at the Upper Room, Church of God in Christ. We are going to be walking in the Word. And by the way, those of you who were looking for us on Ustream last week, the error was not ours. That medium, Ustream, uh, uh, no longer exists. And uh, we are now going to be going live uh, on another uh, in, in another way, and uh, we will fill you in on that. Starting tonight, the Lord willing. God bless.